When students first decide to be an engineer in high school, they make that choice because they want to design something or build something, something cool and interesting, right? And then they go to school, and their first semester, second semester in school, what are they doing? They're in calculus, they're in physics, right? They're maybe an intro to engineering class. They don't get to see that that end, you know, job, that, that thing that they're going to be doing as, at, as an engineer, right, in the end. So um, a competition like this gives them the opportunity to, you know, go through a full design process. Just learning and just having the team together, um, it's been a long process, even though it's been a short time, but I think all of us had a lot of fun just trying to get it to work as best we can. There's 12 trees, and the trees are represented by popsicle sticks set around the track. Um, and the task is to take the trees and chop them down and put them in a pond, kind of like a beaver pond, if you will. So we have a river and a pond. Um, the robot has to be autonomous, so they can't, uh, uh, it, it, there's no remote control, so they push one button and they have to uh, go ahead and finish. Um, they get 120 seconds to complete the task. And there's various points that they can get along the way. So if they just knock the tree down, but they don't pick it up and put it in the pond, they get points. If they push it into the river, they get points. To get the maximum points, they put the trees in the pond itself. So they'll get the most points there. Just focusing on actually starting to create it, we spent a very long time with ideas and trying to get things to go and actually start working, make a cohesive bot was our most challenging thing. The engineers know when you go to work, you will work you have to work as a team. Uh, and this gives these students the opportunity to kind of see where they would fit in the team, you know? Are they a leader? Are they a builder? Are they a designer? Are they good with software, hardware? Where do they fit in? So it gives them the opportunity to kind of see where they fit in and what they might like, what they don't like, and also um, get that first, I think, sense of how to work within a team. Maybe you're not always right. Your idea doesn't get um, selected all the time but they do get together and work. And for this competition, if they don't work as a team, they won't be successful. So the teams that are, are, are together and work and get, you know, work hard together um, in a team environment, they are successful here. We're having a lot of fun. I mean, we're, it's just super enjoyable to watch this and we put a lot of work into it, a lot of ingenuity. I mean, the wheels at first were a gag and here we are, it's working. So just having a lot of fun.